And our final little reading from White Eagle, because no one says it like him. In the White Eagle Lodge, and this makes me want to cry, because it's beautiful. In the White Eagle Lodge, we work on one specific ray to help each other to rise above the limitations of mortal life. Step by step, this is taking place in us all, but so imp imperceptibly that it is not apparent, except perhaps for the atmosphere, which may be felt as a loving atmosphere, because the one foundation upon which these God-created powers can be built is that of devotion and of love. And so, in everyday life, there is a growing of spirit, a kindliness of great true sympathy and love. The devotee feels the spirit of aspiration and devotion to the Master, to the Christ, to the third aspect of the Trinity. Love, gentleness, courtesy, never wearying in well-doing, always being ready to give help when help is called for and not necessarily asked for, but when needed. By this, the heart chakra opens and the light streams forth from the heart. There comes, as it were, a light from within. shining through the eyes, radiating from the body. The rays reach down to within the individual as well as reaching up and out. As the rays go down, they cause stimulation in the nerve center at the base of the spine. This stimulates and raises the serpent power, the creative power, the mother aspect of the deity. And as this power rises up, step by step, it stimulates the other centers in the body. We suggest the only safe method of raising the serpent power is that through the stimulation of the pure love, ray, or the heart center. So shall we join together in meditation? And together, we walk up a beautiful mountain path. The grass is green. We are barefoot. And with every step, we feel lighter and lighter. More free. We hear the sound of the wind. We feel the strength of the earth. We feel the warmth of the sunlight upon our shoulders. We smell the flowers. And as we near the mountain peak, we see a circular outdoor temple with pine forests, pine trees all around. We enter through and sit around a fire. And 
we hear the gentle rain on the other side of the trees. And a great stillness and peace is felt within. And as day turns to night, the animals begin to come out. They peek their little heads around the trees. The fairy kingdom, the salamanders, light up. The awe of magic and life begins to percolate within our hearts. And then we hear the call and we rise as on wings of light into the heavenly state into the temple of the mother. We are guided to a seat that is specific, specifically prepared for each one. And the purest form of the mother pours forth through this temple. As she descends from the heavens, The angels begin to sing and the light pours forth. Divine Mother Love, hearts overflowing, we give our thanks and we are escorted back out from the temple and slide down that ray of light until we again find ourselves seated upon the earth around the fire. And we breathe the essence into our heart, blending the aspects of mother within, the feminine. And a beautiful being comes around to each one, offering the gift of a single raindrop, 
which just sits upon your hand. Knowing that whenever we need help on this earth, this cleansing, beautiful gift of flow, of water, may be remembered to wipe away all that no longer serves gently, lovingly, kindly. And with thanks, we now rise and walk back down the mountain path. And as we do, the daylight shines forth and the sun rises in a gentle pink hue. It's poured over the mountain. And with each step, we bring that gentle pink hue into our being, our life, and our world. And with each step, we become more aware of our physical body as at last we reach the base of the mountain and we breathe in all that we have received into our physical body, down through the crown of our head, through our skull, down through our neck, shoulders, arms, hands, fingers. Breathing down through our chest, our lungs, our torso, hips, legs, shins, calves, ankles, feet. Feeling very connected to the earth. feeling her nurturing, her strength, and at home as we journey on the next stage of our life. And when you are ready, gently rolling your shoulders, stretching your limbs, and opening your eyes, And using the symbol of the equal side across within a circle of light upon our heart and encircling ourselves in light on the in-breath up the left side of the body coming up to the crown of the head and on the outside of the body on the out-breath down the right side coming back underneath the feet to complete the circle. Completely grounded, heart open, mind silenced. Let us close this service in prayer. We turn our faces to the great white spirit and receive into our soul his love his wisdom and his power. We bless and thank our Father, Mother God. May we become ever more worthy to walk in the light. Amen.